What is up Mako Madness fans? This is Dan and we are checking back into the Universal Orlando Resort. However, we're not going to be going over to the other side of the park. We are going to focus on Islands of Adventure. So let's head inside and see what's going on with Hulk and Kong. Normally I'm not here this early in the morning and uh, I gotta say Hulk looks absolutely awesome. With the sun shining on everything else like that. It's looking good. There's not a whole bunch to note other than nets! We have nets! Yay! So that has actually been installed partially and uh, they're going to be finishing it up probably very soon. And over here near the turnaround around the tunnel, we have a worker up there working on some of the conduit lines. And uh, they're securing it to the support. But as we can see, it goes all the way down right there. So even more conduit lines all over the place. Well, we covered it in the last update, but there was a bracket that was welded onto the track. However, it was on the opposite side. So this is another one right here. And it's also connected to that conduit line. But there's a lot more of these showing up all over the place, guys. And just like we pointed out in the last update, with those nets, they had the couplings that were on the supports, and sure enough, that's where they attached to, right there. The work walls over here near the entrance to Hulk have actually been extended out just a little bit. You used to be able to walk around on that pathway to get access to the restrooms over here but now you have to go around over here. So that's one change that I see. But uh, yeah, work walls, send it out. And one other look over here at the guys doing their thing. See that guy right there is in the hole and they're digging out all the muck, all the water so they can get it ready. Alrighty guys, so this is our first look at the Reign of Kong area, and I hate to say it, the work walls are not down just yet. However, they have been pushed back a little bit. We'll walk over here just to show. It's not usually this wide, but uh, we have that area over there, and you can see how it's a little bit discolored, so that shows that it has been pushed back just a little bit, but it extends all the way down, makes it just a little bit wider, but then again, we do not have the walls down. And one last look at the walls that have been pushed back just a little bit, but they are not down. So the chance of rain is not looking good right now, but uh, as soon as the walls do come down, chances are going to go way up. Alrighty guys, so we do have some Mako Madness fans here, Rich and Amy. So once again, if you see me in the park, come say hi, just like these guys. Don't be a stranger, alright? Well guys, that is going to do it for our mini Islands of Adventure update. We went and checked on Hulk and saw that they actually had some blue nets installed directly underneath the Zero-G roll, so it looks really good. And we went to check on Kong to see if there was a chance of rain, and I hate to say it doesn't look too good right now. However, the work walls were pushed back just a little bit. We're going to be continuing to check up on that ride uh, pretty much every day, guys. So if we don't have a video every day, at least we're going to have an update on our Facebook saying whether or not it is going to be open. So if you like what we do, follow us on Instagram, follow us on Facebook, and our YouTube page at Make a Madness, and I will see you out on the Midway.